Hi everyone, welcome to Mama's Kitchen. Yeah, today I'm going to season turkey leg here. Yeah, we need to see how you can use your turkey leg and then season it. I'm sure that you've seen it, especially in the UK and other places. You go to shop is there. It's something that you can do for your dinner or lunch. Yeah. I've cut everywhere now, as you can see. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So now I'm going to wash my hands and come back. The season that I'm using today is uh, I'm using all my dry season now, just like a bit of honey as well. Yeah. So this is my onion powder here. A bit of all. Yeah. A bit of all my season. Let's see. Half a teaspoon of onion powder. This is chicken season. Yeah. One teaspoon of that. Cajun spice. One teaspoon of that. And then garlic. Half a teaspoon of garlic here. Because most of my season has a garlic in any way. Black pepper. Half a teaspoon of black pepper. Half a teaspoon of chili powder. Okay. And then I'm gonna mix everything together. I always like my Lee and Perry. So I add some Maggi sauce here. Yeah, couple of drizzle of that. And then also my Lee and Perry. Yeah, that one drizzle. Also a couple of that as well. And then I need to mix everything together here. Something like a paste. And let me drizzle some of honey. Let's see. That's my honey there. Yeah, I like that. Turkey and honey is beautiful together. And I have my paste as you can see. This is look like a paste. So I'm going to rub everything on my turkey. And of course, I have to add my salt as well, yeah? Let's see, half teaspoon of salt as well. It depends on how you want your salt, yeah? So I'm going to rub this in my turkey leg here, the season. Okay? Rub so that you can see what I'm doing here. I'm sure my camera can see. Okay. So now, it's like paste. I want the season to be nice, lovely, everywhere. Yeah? So I'm going to clean them, the meat, leave it in the fridge for overnight, and then I'll cook it. Okay? So this is something that you can do. So when everything is done, I'll show you how the whole thing is going to look like. Okay? So, thank you. Hi, welcome to Mama's Kitchen today. Um, this is the turkey drumstick that I prepared yesterday that's uh, seasoned. So I'm going to, you know, roast the leg and then later on I'll show you, okay? So this is it. It's well, well seasoned for overnight. So now it's time for me to cook it, okay? So now, this, this is my potatoes here. I'm going to peel it, yeah? And then boil I use it for my dinner this evening, okay? Cut it. I'm going to peel all the potato. Use the this potato peeler here. I'm going to use it. Let me just peel one for you to see how I'm going to peel the whole thing. Like that. Okay. And then I'm going to slice it and then boil. Okay, when I finish our slice, wash and slice and then cook it. And you know. The rest will follow, okay? So this is the potatoes, yeah? I'll finish peeling it, cut it, so I'm going to cook it. I don't have, I don't want to cook it fully, fully cooked. Halfway, then I'll strain it and then continue, okay? 
So I'm going to prepare gravy here. Yeah, homemade gravy. This is plain flour, four tablespoons of plain flour, two stock keep here. I'm going to add a bit of onion, you know, a bit of everything here, like my the seasoning one here. A bit of onion here. Onion powder, this is onion powder, yeah. This is instant gravy. And then garlic, quarter of a teaspoon of garlic. Chicken season, this one, one tablespoon of that because I like that is nice. And then black pepper, half of a teaspoon of black pepper. Sorry. This is it, this one. And this is one tablespoon of natural brown sugar. Yeah, the dark one, really dark one. Here as well. And this is it. So, this is the gravy, yeah, gravy mix. Yes. So this is the gravy. Yeah? You add margarine, one tablespoon of margarine. I'm using light margarine here. I already asked some. This is just a bit down to show you. Okay? So now I'm ready to cut my turkey gravy. Beautiful and it's so tasty. I tell ya. you. Need to make and try and see how it's like. Okay? So I'll be right back. Thank you. So now this is my potatoes here. So this is the potatoes here. Now it's cooked. So I'm going to fry it. This is different way. This one you don't do every day. Once a while, once a while they be fry it. Most of the time I roast my potatoes. I don't normally fry it, but it's nice when you do it once a while. It's not so bad. So this is my oil here. I'm going to drop this butter in as you can see here. So that the butter will give you lovely flavor as well. If you don't have butter, not much. This is butter. If you don't have it, you can use coconut oil, one tablespoon of coconut oil, yeah? Let's give it a while. I'm going to fry it. Take the soup. I'm going to put some in here. This is very, very soft. And then it's a little bit. Yeah, and then it's a little bit. And then it's a little bit. And then it's a little bit. Just like the way that I fried my yarn, if you have some of the fry yarn with you, you just burn it again. So I'm going to let it cook, and then I'll come back and see if it's not fine with you. Okay? Now the potato is ready, so let's just see here, taking some. So, we're going to fry the rest of the potato. We take it from there, okay? Now this is my potato, yeah? It's done, as you can see. Nice and golden brown. Crispy, beautiful looking, and tasty as well, yeah? I'm going to add sea salt. Yeah? And then, I'm going to let it sit in the oven for, let's say, five minutes, and then I'll serve it, okay? Hi, this is my most natural kitchen. Welcome back to my kitchen, yeah? This is my salad. This is the food I prepared. From yesterday and then today this is the end result the meat and everything so this is my salad that's my potato and this is my turkey leg yay see so this is something that you can try and then buy some yeah so look at it wow beautiful so nice and soft and juicy yeah oh see it's falling from the bone already oh So now this is my take here. Okay. And then salad on the side here. More salad. It's my fruit and bean salad. When you make this kind of potato, yeah, this is something that you can also do. Very simple. You fry it. 
see how nice and crunchy. You know, this is pepper. I'm sure that you have seen this in my channel. Yeah, this kind of pepper. Yeah, you've seen this in my channel. So, some of the potato, and I put some pepper here. Just like my Ayachi, but this one is another level. It's very nice. So, try it when you have fried something like that. You have pepper that I blend on my channel. You can do this one also. Yeah, very, very delicious. So nice. Okay. Very, 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 very nice. One day to chop that, you know, that's why you will see very, very. See, let me try it for you to see. Hmm, see how nice and soft, just like that. Okay, with your pepper, try. Mm -mm. Oh, yeah, very delicious. Try this or with meat, you will love it. Thanks, okay. So that's the main menu. That's my gravy. Take your gravy there. Homemade gravy. The remaining of the everything. To try it. Thank you. So this is the gravy that I prepared. As you saw me prepare. Yeah? A little gravy here as well. Okay. That's take your gravy. So this is it. So please, when you watch my video, subscribe and share also. Mama Lee, she was thanks for watching Mama's Natural Kitchen. Thank you.